steel is an everyday construction material. Um, it's used everywhere, right, in terms of Singapore and Southeast Asia and the world. And as we continue to grow our cities, our economies will continue needing to use this very important material. However, at the same time, steel contributes close to 10% of global carbon dioxide emissions annually. So in terms of accelerating our fight against climate change, we really need to think about how do we decarbonize this industry as fast as possible. So we've made an investment in a company called Electra that is really developing a novel and quite innovative uh, process for iron making. Specifically, iron making being the, the first step that you need to do in terms of steel making. Now, the, the technology we've been using to produce iron and steel is generally done at very high temperatures, and by very high temperatures, I mean sort of 1,000 degrees and above, even close to 2,000 degrees Celsius, and, and that is generated by burning things like coal or, or natural gas. Electra, on the other hand, is able to take this process and do it close to room temperature at 60 degrees Celsius using renewable energy. So if we think about the iron and steel making industry, these are huge, large plants. There's, there's billions of dollars of existing plants that have been installed, and to replace some of that equipment takes time. And this is really where Tamasek's long-term catalytic capital comes in. There's not many investors which are able to make these longer-term investments and to see these technologies grow and to really reach their full potential. So I'm part of a team within Tamasek that looks at our deep tech investments. So when we look at these new technologies, aside from looking at that potential, that technology to scale or, or the performance, it's also very important to look at the economic viability. It's really a privilege to play my small part in moving the needle on combating climate change. If we think about how much time we have left really to accelerate our, our efforts in climate change, we, we need to move today, we need to move now.